Hi, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Laurie, and today I participated in the Mad Hatter's Tea Table Skate Challenge hosted by Secondhand Tracy Ann and Crafty Kitty. They are two amazing women, so make sure you check out their channels. I'm going to list them both below in my description. I just wanted to say I'm an absolute blast participating in this challenge, and I had the opportunity to actually pull out some of the vintage teacups and teapots that I inherited from my mother and my grandmother. So it was kind of fun because I felt like they were actually part of this challenge with me, and I really, really enjoyed myself. I hope you have fun coming along on this crazy ride with me. I had so much fun, and if you haven't yet subscribed, you know what to do. Just click that little red subscribe button below and hit the notification bell, and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. My tablescape begins outdoors on a beautiful afternoon. I started with a plain white tablecloth and then I found this beautiful piece of fabric that reminded me of the Mad Hatter, so I just placed it on top at an angle. I then began adding my teapots one by one and this was so fun as most of them are vintage from my mother and my grandmother. I then embraced my inner hatter and began placing the teacups and saucers randomly about the table. Of course, proper etiquette, we needed to place some napkins for the messy guests. I used green ivy and placed it about my tablescape to bring it to life. And what's a tea party without tea cakes and cookies? Once those were in place, I added a pop of color by using some beautiful flowers. Once all the flower accents were in place, it was then time for the guests to arrive. First to make his appearance was the Dormouse. Then the Hatter himself. And of course, the March Hare took his place at the table. Then it was time to start the tea party. That's when the White Rabbit showed up. Of course, he was late, but he did have his trusty pocket watch. Then, of course, beautiful Alice made her appearance. I hope you enjoy my Mad Hatter Tea Tablescape. Now I know what you're thinking, where is the Cheshire Cat? He appeared only for a moment, but I was able to snap a quick picture before he was gone. If you haven't yet subscribed, you know what to do. Just click that little red subscribe button below, and I'll see you soon. Bye, everybody!